Oh, this is going to be one shiny yellow car, let me tell you. This is going to be awesome. Oh, I love good. it. Hey, this is going to be good. Here we are at uh, Showtime Muscle Cars with Roger and Oliver. And today is the day that the Charger gets painted, the main body. The shop is closed to everyone. It's just uh, Roger and Oliver here preparing the car to uh, get painted. This is something I wanted to see for a long time. I'm sure Eugene is the same way. He's waiting to see this car getting painted. And of course, for many, many other viewers have been asking me the question, what's happening with the 500? Well, here it is. Today it's gonna get shot. So it's gonna take a few, uh, a few hours actually, because now they're just gonna prep it, tape it up. They're gonna shoot a white sealer on it, let it dry for a few hours. And after that, Roger's gonna do his magic with Oliver and then get the original Y2 yellow paint job on it. And this is gonna be the magic moment that everybody's waiting for. So Roger, what do you say? You're ready today to do the job? Yes, sir. Uh, we are there. Everyone's waiting on you on this job, uh, Roger. <laughs> I, know, I know, I see all the crewmen. And all those guys are really anxious to see the car uh, painted yellow, but you know, you when you want a, a nice job, you have to take the time. Of course. And I don't work only on that car. I have other cars. Yes. Like everyone, so, yeah. You know, I try to do my best to finish the car, man. And by the way, I came here last night at 10 o'clock in the evening, and Oliver and Roger were still working on the car. Even though I left at roughly 10.30, they were still working on the car. I want to give a special thank you to Roger for letting us bring our cameras into a uh, video Eugene's Charger here. Uh, I know he's a busy man, he's got other clients too with other cars, but uh, today he's let us in, he's closed the shop to everyone. He wants to come in and work with Oliver to get this car painted. And, our, and uh, Roger, I want to thank you very much for letting us come in with our cameras, make a video. And I'm sure you're going to be equipped with some cameras in the paint booth to do some shooting. And good luck, buddy. And I can't wait to see this done. Thank you. 1969 Dodge Charger 500 that belongs to Eugene in Austin, Texas. You know, the more I look at this color, the more I love it. I just gotta admit, it's beautiful. And you know, Roger and Oliver are doing a great job on this. You guys are looking at every square inch of this car. No, I noticed and you guys are so picky. You guys are more picky than I am. Anyways, it's gonna be nice, really nice. It's gonna paint it to the original glory color. A Y2 yellow, which I believe is called Sunfire Yellow, which Eugene has bought this car brand new back in 1968 or early 69, back in uh, New Jersey. He's had it stored for many, many years in uh, so many different places because he was based here and based there and whatever. And we pulled out of uh, Ontario, California last year. Brought it here to Montreal to get it done, fully restored. So we're doing our best to do the, what we can, and we want to show everybody in Texas uh, what kind of work we do. The engine bay, interior, and trunk have all had their final shot of paint earlier, so some careful masking is needed before the work today.
Now we clean the car, outside the paint, everywhere. After we put the car in, start the fan, wear our uh, suit, and clean it back again. Magic moment, let's go. The more you prepare, the better it is. You don't want to have a fish eye, so this take up all the, uh, the greasy zone and clean for the uh, sending uh, dust. They should remind them of all the way down. Special mission. Over to the moon. Yeah, I remember when they built that lunar module for the moon uh, back in uh, 1969 for Apollo 11. This LP reminds me of that uh, special mission. And for me, this is a special mission in the same way with the 69 Charger 500. And uh, it sure brings back some history, let me tell you. One giant Opar for us. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> yeah. This is a big car. That's a really big car. Finally, after waiting for its owner to return from a war, after moving and racing all over the United States, and after spending more than 40 years in storage, Eugene's 1969 Charger 500 is rolling into the booth for a fresh coat of paint. The doors are closing, you know what that means. So it's time to uh, shoot some paint on it. The first material Roger will be using today is an epoxy sealer. This modern coating wasn't used back in the day. But the guys want to create a factory correct overspray look on the belly of the charger. So while Roger is mixing up the first of the sealer, Oliver is masking off the underside of the car. Man, 
man, the magic moment is here. Oh, it still has a lot of prep to do, let me tell you. Painting this, then we gotta start working on fenders and hood, putting that all together, then all the fine trim. And this is gonna be one fine beauty looking charger, let me tell you. Of light on the charger and it looks great let me tell you after that we're gonna wait a few hours then we're gonna shoot it yellow yeah way number one that's gonna be nice it's gonna be nice yeah oh, this car stuff, has to be man. nice oh yeah. looks good already man let me tell you it looks good already there's no doubt that the 69 Charger 500 is looking better already, but there's still lots of work to be done before the guys are ready to call it a night. The sealer will need hours to dry, but the hockey game is on the radio, and despite the long hours of hard work ahead, everyone is excited to see this one complete. These hockey fans have been working hard since this morning, but at 10 o'clock at night, the sealer is finally dry and the charger is ready to see some color.
The Y2 yellow paint is going down smooth and even, and the charger is looking better by the minute. The icing on the cake for the guys tonight. The Montreal Canadiens score with less than five minutes left in overtime to stay alive in the race for the Stanley Cup. The Chargers' transformation is already remarkable, but the night's work won't be complete until the car shines. Yellow was painted, and now we got the clear coat. Ah, oh, this is gonna be one shiny yellow car, let me tell you. It's gonna be awesome. I love it. Hey, this is gonna be good. looks sharp let me tell you really sharp I feel like walking in there <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like walking in there but I don't want to cause any dust or anything like that but anyways it looks good looks good yeah
There's still a daunting list of things to be done before Eugene's charger is ready to kick the tires and light the fires once more. But this special mission just took a giant leap forward, thanks to Roger, Oliver, and Fern at Showtime Muscle Cars and Nick's Garage. And you guys, if you look down below the video, we have a whole bunch of merchandise that you guys can buy. So whatever you like, buy it, love it, wear it, and enjoy it. And help spread the word of Nick's Garage. And if you have some time, check out our Patreon page. We have extra content and you guys can watch it and take it from there. And we'll see you next time.